Hi guys, in this video we are going to discuss about how to check the delivery status. Now you must be thinking what is delivery status, right? So if you take the example of WhatsApp, right? So in the WhatsApp you see something like this, uh, double take, single take, uh, gray take, blue take, right? So those take or is the information uh, like the message is delivered, read and all those things. So what Delio supports uh, from SMS side, right? is two things one is sent one is delivered okay now for that uh, i have already created a one small uh, code example where we are just going to pass uh, one what do you say status uri or web service url which is nothing but capturing the uh, status of the sms like what is the status and what are the information we get from the tlio once uh, you send the sms to the tlio okay now, if you want to know about the how to send, there is already a video created. Uh, description is given in the other video link is given in the comment, uh, description section. And then the code is this code is already available over here in the GitHub. Okay, so let's start. Okay, so now what we will do is this is just a, what you say Node.js Express uh, code. It is running on the port number 3000 and we created one post api right api uh, with the post and what we are doing is whatever the response is coming i'm just printed out into the console okay so let me start the server uh, let me go to the studio send sms okay so i will start this one uh, what was that sms uh, capture status so once i do that it start in the local host now starting into the local host doesn't help anything right we have to pass a url to Tilio, uh, which is accessible to the public right now for that what we will use is ngrock okay so i have already downloaded the ngrock uh, this is for the window so we are running in http and i'm running in the port number http 3000 so I will copy this URL, okay, and I will go back to my send SMS code, okay, and I will enable one comma over here, the status, okay, paste over here, and slash status is nothing but uh, this thing, uh, the path which we are listening for the API, from the API. Okay, so all done. Now what I will do, I will again send the SMS. Okay, so let's uh, send some different SMS this time. Uh, hello there, something like this. Uh, where is my phone? Uh, let me send the SMS. Okay, so now I am sending the SMS. So once I send the SMS, I get one SMS ID. I will go to my other... Uh, where we are listening. So if you see over here, uh, I will just put it side by side so that you can see. So the SMS ID that I got, right? 747125. So if you see over here, uh, what you sent me, there are two information or two events you can say. One is uh, it has been sent status and another one is delivered. So if I go to my mobile, See, it has been delivered over here, you can see. Uh, uh, or There are other information also mentioned, like my account ID, uh, what is the mobile number, and two phone number, and any other information, which is message ID, second SMS ID. So yeah, this is the information that we get. And if you want to create or build a system, so first you get a system, right? Where you're sending a, or sending a message as a broadcasting message to your user. Uh, you want to know that if the number has been sent or it has been delivered or not. Uh, unfortunately, there is nothing called a read uh, from SMS side, uh, which TV provides. So at least you can provide this to notification or the information. So this is similar to what we have in the TV, like, uh, sorry, in the WhatsApp, like single tick or double tick. Single tick is sent from your side. Double tick, it's mean it has been delivered. And the double tick, which is in 
the blue it means it has been read but uh, for sms we can at least go till double take which is in gray uh yeah hopefully you find this information useful uh do like the video thank you